Welcome back to Airborne Productions. If you work in a shop, you absolutely need this tool, hands down. So you're probably thinking this is clickbait. Oh, it's a hammer or a drill or a welder or whatever the case, but no, it is not what you're thinking. The tool I'm talking about is a bandsaw. Considering how inexpensive these things are, there's absolutely no reason you shouldn't be using these to cut. And if you don't believe me, here's a piece of 4140 steel, three and a half inch diameter. The bandsaw cut through it in about 20 minutes. Whereas the cutoff wheel, well, it took about an hour to go absolutely nowhere. So if you ever cut something metal, you've probably used, I don't know, a hacksaw, or maybe a cutoff wheel, or a sawzall, or something like that. They work, but oftentimes your cuts suck. It takes a while, it's hard to do. Wears you out, wears your tools out. It's not the best way of doing things. So this here is a central machinery or harbor freight horizontal vertical metal cutting bandsaw. It's got a one horsepower motor that spins a 62 and a half inch blade. Operation couldn't be easier. Drop your steel down in there, clamp it down, turn her on. Like gravity cut. And just like that, right when it's done cutting, it turns itself off. If you want to adjust your tension on how hard this thing's coming down, that adjustment's right here. The more you tighten this, the more tension's put on the spring, which means the less weight is being pulled down. Blades, like we said, are 62 and a half inches. They're anywhere from eight to 16 bucks at Harbor Freight. And we've had the best luck with the 18 tooth per inch blades over the 24 tooth per inch blade. You can also adjust the speed at which the blade moves. You simply move this belt to the different pulleys. You go anywhere from 80 to 120 to 200 feet per minute. You can easily adjust where this thing sits as well as loosening these bolts to adjust the angle which this sits at. In my opinion, this thing is the best tool that you can have in your shop for 200 bucks. We bought this thing for 150 bucks used, knew it's about 249 at Harbor Freight. This is the closest thing to a CNC that I can afford. You get it cutting and you can go walk away and do something else and it turns itself off when it's done. What more could you ask for? As you see, we're doing another cut here on that same piece of 4140, but this time we're doing it diagonally, which means there's a lot of surface area being cut. Keep in mind, the diameter of that 4140 is three and a half inches. It's pretty hard stuff. This bandsaw is really the only way to cut it properly. Another benefit to cutting 4140 with the bandsaw is that we can place a tray underneath it to catch all the dust that falls off. That way, if we ever decide to use this 4140 for, say, a canister of Damascus, we can pour all that dust in between our large pieces inside the canister. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe as it helps us out. Also, don't be afraid to hit your local hardware store for a bandsaw. We'll be very glad that you did. Thanks.